Hello there. In this video, I want to go over 10 generative AI services that we can use it for free. And first, we start with a Wombo, one of the first who allowed to create very stunning images. And I remember how it was impressive to use it on mobile devices. However, it slowly start falling behind. The engine still look a little bit too abstract and outdated. As well, the options that you need actually pay money to uh, use it more sophisticated models. It's kind of putting this overall service on the 10th place for me. On the ninth place, it will be DALI. And at one time it was on a tube or a top of food chain for AI generative art. After time, they stopped kind of updating engine. It seems like the service stopped progressing after they created Chat GPT and spent probably majority and make even worse even the original first users when they come. This used to receive credits every month for free to use. Now you actually need to, for new users, you need purchase credits to use. So because of that, that is a drop down from almost top down to ninth place our eight place divide between very similar type of the services online or sites that provide the most of them will allow you to access a multiple different type of the engines or models as well many of them allow you to create an sfw type of the images not safe for workplace so you can create all this big variety an assault jam creative art which is well similar one the other ones mage just slightly different because you actually can go and select models all of them you can create for free with a mage space you can create stable diffusion for free and stable diffusion 2.1 if you register next one if cryon for me stay in the same type of the niche all of this it's a share eight place and again i just put it out only five of the services it's way more there available that in a very very similar niche seventh place i'm putting art breather this is again one of the oldest service this is a little bit different render from your other one usability because you can merge here you can actually mix together portions landscape you can create all this different you can create also animations and other elements i will provide for you video down below to review a little bit closer what art breather can do and how you can create very nice morphing animations and also i will provide link for all of this resource that i mentioned so you can go directly and check by yourself but this one is interesting service overall you can do some stuff for free here and of course if you need it utilize more heavier create more images everything then you need pay most credits will re renew monthly in art breather so you have some limitations but you can still using this service for free application which represent very stable <laughs> it will be from microsoft image creator which utilize same power by dali e so it is same engine because it's a free instead going and sign up on dali's you can go directly to microsoft edge which is required for you to install it and after this you can go and create images and as well on us i will put a dream studio engine the reason is for me it's on same level because they don't allow any extended type new models you can integrate or other things but they're both very solid production on the image generating art in both ways and next we have two another of somewhat similar services one it will be canvas and the reason is why services because they allowed us for free create more than just generative images you can implement them so one is a camera if you can create a many different projects different titles wherever it also render and create the images inside ai generate images and this is a little bit more than just generation the image compositing application and same with adobe express adobe express same you can create many different types for the posting social media and with the beta new you also have a creative ai so, and for that reason this is two for me on the same level well, and above this next i will put it adobe firefly even adobe express does utilize some ai from firefly here you will have a little bit more options that you can create it also include inside a new photoshop where you can extend your canvases you can create quite a bit actually sophisticated images because it's not yet all the way back a lot of options still be waiting for them to release so it's the reason why it's not on top i think the night cafe really deserve that place it's a very solid very old service that keep on updating they release new sdxl 0.9 model you can select different models right here i have it over a thousand credits and honestly i paid zero so i did not pay anything for using this service they just send credits and you can collect them daily and build up so you can 
can develop. They're very, very generous about allowing you to do this on daily or hourly. I do like this service. I like how they're working. I like how they're updating. And I think this is solid third place deserve for this second place it is leonardo ai i keep on getting impressed about how well the steam who developing this interface application and model how well they're actually adding new stuff and some so unique you cannot find on another places for example where you have it generating texture directly on three models so you can actually have it 3d models imported and generating this way there also you have options to create your own training databases so you can take your images training like a dream booth create your own images as well you can extend canvas working on multiple different canvases and recent updates canvas now in not just only stable diffusion you can use it all different models here as well when you work on a canvas so it's very solid very well done product and amount of the models they provided a kind of quite bit quite bit extensive you have it access to a lot of different models without paying premium for example like mage space they do have a lot of models but you need to pay premium here you don't they assign you 150 credits every day you can use it for whatever you need it so it's again very generous for you to go explore and build up also you have access to community models it's what other people create and share this as well you can create your own models like i did it based on my photography or you can do other ways so it's very interesting model very solid provide excellent excellent kind of upkeeping to new technology before I jump to number one, I want to give it honorable mention to Mid Journey. And the reason is honorable mention because it is not free anymore. To use this service, you actually need to subscribe. You need to pay money for this. But it is a quality of generated art. It's a top notch. For me, I try so many different type of services, models and everything. I still thinking that right now we don't have it anyone who can produce better than Mid Journey. At least let me rephrase anyone openly <laughs> for the public to access better than mid journey can produce quality of the renders and quality of the models and everything so this is there but only does not have any place because it is a pay only right now number one stable diffusion local installation reason is why it allowed you so much options so many extensions you can create from animations very complex animations very images it provides excellent tool for you i know other ones more kind of web based but generally what i will try to cover are free tools that allow you to create it you can have it local or remove it also stable diffusion if you have it open your api you can access remotely to your server from any web or web browser outside your computer personally so you can set up this and beside install the lone local machine you can also go in and install or use it there a uh, google uh, notebooks call up so you can run directly from this code and of course stable diffusion allowed you to access hundreds of different models in different flavors um, some of them good some of them is not good but it's everything you can find there only the number one tool that any digital artist must to know or have let me know what you think let me know if i miss some any cool service please put it in your comments below thank you for watching thank you for your support and have a great